number seven, and we are very excited about this part of the new shelter. This is our multi-use room, and it's going to be equipped with uh, tables and chairs. It can be arranged in a number of different areas. We're also going to have a food prep area over to the side here, um, and then uh, we're going to have an overhead projector set up to do multimedia uh, presentations like PowerPoints and films and things like that. Uh, the big advantage that we have in this room is that we can do so much more right here on site compared to the current facility where we have to do a lot of our programming off-site in libraries and things like that. So we'll be able to hold our committee meetings in here, our volunteer orientations. We'll also be able to uh, have our board meetings in, in this area. Um, and instead of like having everybody go out into the community for those, we can do this right here on site. A huge advantage for the volunteer orientations is that we can give people hands-on experience right after their orientation so they can see exactly where they're going to be working. Uh, we have another, uh, uh, a number of other programs that we do with uh, Boy Scouts, Girl Scouts, um, where they're earning uh, merit badges and learning about uh, how to take care of pets. Uh, we do a uh, summer camp every year with uh, kids from the gathering place. All of those are going to be really enhanced by having the ability to put people in a room where they can sit down, interact with an instructor and each other. We're hoping that we can also expand programs for the community Things like um, education programs for pets, dog training, um, and another thing that we've been doing through the years is our microchip and shock clinics. And again, those were always done at various locations. We'll be able to do those right here on site and make it much more accessible to the entire community. Uh, we hope that you'll be able to come out and take advantage of some of the programs that ARP is going to offer once we're open in the new shelter. So thanks for watching. Look for that tag at the end of the video to send you to the website to learn more about the new shelter and ways that you can support it.